Today we're doing Trulies. It's time to get Monday drunk. Also, I'm gonna get really high. <laughs> you know, it's Monday. Hold on, huh? Car gonna be gone. It's a fun spray you can buy. Um, this is our, I think, fifth seltzer video. Uh, two weeks ago, we did the high noons, and we loved them. Uh, Corey, what do we got today? Today, we've got Truly's Lemonades, and before I talk about uh, our first flavor, damn, bro, you're flexible as hell. Oh, oh, get up. I am the Matrix. But this is what I'm getting at. I find it interesting that on the can, the first thing I see, less than 1% juice. Wow. And to be honest with you, that is a very low number. Be loud and proud, yeah, right? <laughs> right? This isn't like body fat. Like I like, yeah. Man, I got less than 1% body fat. Like, dude, <laughs> you mean the natural part of your thing? Do you think we're so less- So what is it, 90% aluminum? Do you think between the two of us, we're less than 1% muscle? <laughs> Potentially. It's like, hey, look, ladies and gentlemen, we got a lot of sugar in here and you're gonna have to deal with it. If you think you're getting juice, next up. But anyways, here we go. Uh, ready to dive in? He, guy loves high noons. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what do we got first? First up, black cherry lemonade, or as Sean says. <laughs> Please cut it in, because if you only use me singing buck cherry, it's not gonna take. Uh, we got black cherry. I like to call it buck cherry. If you think that that bit will end, I, that bit will end when companies stop making black cherry flavored things. Which or we're never. Can we end it if? And I'm only saying this in the high hopes that this happens. Yes. What is it? Buck cherry agrees to be a guest on one of our episodes. Either that or like get them back together for Riot Fest. What are we waiting for? Oh, bro, that'd be sick. Um, I'm excited. Ready? Yeah. Uh, this has been a bit. Three, two, one. So good, dude. We, we're not good at much, but we're good at that. All right, cheers. cheers. Damn, hard on the sugar, huh? Holy moly. But so, I mean, go ahead. Go no, ahead. No, I, no, you go ahead, because whatever I say is gonna be the dumbest thing these people hear today. <laughs> I was gonna say, I think lemonade, just like by its nature, it is. is a super sugary so, thing. Because I mean, think about it, it's three ingredients. It's, it's water, it's lemons, which are and then just buckets, buckets of sugar. Oh, just, like, you ever walked by, like, oh, little, like, <laughs> this is, I, I grew up in the 40s. Little Sally Mae has a lemonade stand, and she's just going, Ugh! and she's, mommy bought her a bag of sugar, and she's not scarce with it, dude. That's where we're at, though. You're 100% right, dude. So I have never had a uh, Truly Seltz, uh, Truly Lemonade, a Bud Light Lemonade, whatever, whoever. First lemonade this is my had. first yeah, lemonade seltzer me of too. all time, and I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm terrified. Let me ask you a question. Are you a fan of lemonades? Of course. See, here's the thing. I'm really Wait, not. what do you mean though? What do you mean by that? Like just like a like you mean like a like a minute maid? Like uh, I mean like any a, like of a non I'm not even a fan of any of them. Really? I'm not a big You know lemonade what's guy. funny? I think about it. I don't when's the last time I drank a lemonade? I got I get lemonade. I'm, I'm a 34 big... years old. Yeah. Why that's... would I drink lemonade? Um, I can tell you right now that if this is the trend for the rest of this lineup, I'm going to be very negative. There's a lot going on. <laughs> Alright, so next up. Go for it. Mango Lemonade Hard Seltzer. Okay, I'm way more excited for mango. I love mangoes. If you find a way to screw this up. Three, two, one. I think you were a little late on that. That was me, 100%. <laughs> I, I hate to admit fall, but it was me. Way better. Way better. Way better. Like, does the mango cut the sugar? I mean, it's still way too sugary. I think it's way sugary. Who's drinking these? I think you have six of, uh, you can't have more than four or five of these probably because the sugar level. But the mang mango's a better mix with sugar than, bl than black cherry, duh. You're 100% right. Can I also air another grape? Oh, I can't wait. Let's just go into the fine, you know what people don't do when they're drinking? They don't go into the fine print. That's why this show exists. Let's talk about way too many cities being in three lines. Okay, an affiliate of the Boston Beverage Company in 
Baringsville, Pennsylvania, in Cincinnati, Ohio, Memphis, Tennessee, Latrobe, Pennsylvania, and La Crosse, Wisconsin. Pick a damn city, make it there, and shut up. Sorry, it's Monday, I've had a long weekend. Um, anyways, all joking aside, this one is way better than Buck Cherry. Way better. Uh, that is currently in first place. Mango, first place. All right, ready? Yeah. I mean, oh, oh, right, you do your thing. Interlude music. Do 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 Medicine. What do we got next? Next up, we got, I mean, probably the better lemonade than regular, strawberry lemonade. I think everyone can agree if you combine strawberry. All right, ready? Three, yeah. two, one. So good. I mean, we both can. Cheers. Cheers. I think it's better than the regular lemonade, but it's too subtle to overtake the mango. I am so mad that that's how quickly you came up with my exact mentality. Yeah, you sucked it out of your soul. What? Um, you're so right. Like, it's good. Where's the strawberry? Mm. It's, you're right, it's, what are you looking at? I just never noticed how blonde your arm here is. I know, I got very blonde. Will you pull this one out? That's a little long. See that one? See this one here? Well, that's normal. Oh, yeah, you, you gotta right. keep it's that. Kinda, you gotta keep that. Sorry. This is so, like, this is not, I don't, like, it's so subtle. Like, where is? So subtle. The mango's better. I'm, this is, you're right, it's going right in the slit. Uh, that is. Ugh. Why does your thumbnail look like it's got pizza sauce on it? My thumbnail. It looks all orange. We like filmed a lot of videos, man. Yeah, but why me... you got pizza sauce all gunked up? I know in that's there. going in the edit, but I'm not happy about it. <laughs> yeah, that's second place. All right, last one. Last one. <laughs> the original lemonade. Three, two, one. So good. Close. Cheers. Cheers. Okay. I'll say this. It's exactly what I expected. Let me. It's like, it's sugary, it's too sugary. But like, kind of... <sighs> so you really like that one. Bro, this is not as sugary as black cherry. Okay, let me go back to buck cherry. Oh, hold on, Oop, that's my last place. Let me go to buck cherry. I thought the original lemonade was gonna be more sugary. Oh! That's so gross. God! Okay, this is gonna be a, a take. <laughs> Have you ever had absinthe the right way? Yeah, I like the So you know how, okay. So you put the spoon on the glass and, and then you melt the, the sugar the, cube? Yeah, sugar cube, yep. And so Holy when you smokes. do absinthe the right way, cause it's so hallucinogenic and so strong, you need to dilute it with like, first of all, it's so strong, you need sugar. But you need it to like, for whatever reason, people in Europe like want it to be like kind of milky looking, like cloudy. So that's what a sugar cube oh. does. This tastes like just the sugar cube melted from absinthe. This, it's Is so that gross. weird? I feel no, like that's, that's pretty perfect. spot on. And if you so don't get that reference, on, go to Europe and get drunk on absinthe. You'll have a great it's time. It's so spot on because this is like that sugar, the when it when sugar melts, it's more like syrupy. Exactly. And this is like syrupy. I'm excited to see your I, That's not that bad at all. Um, okay, let me do the whole thing. Okay, hold on, whoa. <laughs> you know, okay, I feel very confident yeah, about I, where I'm I get at where you're right going. Now. This is still a little too sugary for me. Yeah. But it's way closer to the perfect amount of sugar. Where I see if you want some sugar, these are way more subtle, both of these. And so if you want sugar, I can see how this would be first place for you. Yeah, okay, well. And then I have strawberry lemonade as my number two spot. Okay. And then mango lemonade for me. I, I mean. That's a, a bit, it's still subtle. Yeah. Not very sugary, mm -hmm. but then has just a better flavor. I, I like the mango flavoring better than the strawberry. It comes out a little bit more mm -hmm. and just tastes a little, little better to me, so that's okay. where my three are. I respect that. The main takeaway from this video is black cherry's trash. trash. Like trash. literal trash. Like they made this because I think they knew black cherry was a popular seltzer. Yeah. For some reason, White Claw and Truly original, people like it. Like I mean, people black cherry like soda. It. They used to have when black I was cherry soda. Up, they had that. Yeah. Um, third place, strawberry lemonade. Okay. Uh, silver medal, mango lemonade, gold medal. You just won the GD Olympics, dude, on this random Monday. Uh, original Lemonade, which I, I'm gonna be honest, I didn't expect. I expected Mango to win. I, for some reason, it's like there's like an added sh artificialness to it on my dumb tongue. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. Do you um, think that this is more sugary a little no, bit? No. no. It is more, it's, I mean, it's so much more salt than the black cherry. 
Um, let us know what you think of these. Uh, it, what's your ranking? Comment it below. And any other, other seltzers we should try in the future. We have so many to go through. Sure, I'll have a drink.